Master Braga told me you were coming. Warren Sidoru, a pleasure. I'm grateful for your assistance. The situation is growing desperate. The Republic picked an unfortunate time to drive the Empire off Balmora. It's made our team's mission that much harder. Every world we take from the Empire brings us one step closer to victory. True, but I hope to achieve our goal with minimal violence. That's hard to do in a war zone. Balmora is home to the largest weapon manufacturing plants in the galaxy. Half the munitions used in the last war originated on this world. The Empire develops horrific new instruments of destruction here. Balmora's creations have killed countless innocents. All that terrible power in the hands of the Sith. We can't let them keep it. I appreciate the sentiment, but be mindful of our mission. We're here for one particular item. We've learned the Empire has a cloaking device prototype at one of Balmora's advanced weapon factories. It's the same technology hiding the Emperor's fortress. If we obtain that cloaking device prototype, we can understand how it works, develop a way to see through it. Expose his hidden fortress and the Emperor becomes vulnerable. Finding the cloaking device prototype is almost impossible thanks to the invasion. We need experienced native guides to sort through the chaos. Balmora has a well-established civilian resistance. Their spy network's knowledge of the Empire would be invaluable. Sounds like we'll need the Resistance if we're going to find the cloaking device. Unfortunately, the Resistance doesn't trust the Republic. Despite my best negotiations, they remain uncooperative. Can't say I blame them. The Empire's driven us off this planet twice already, leaving the Resistance holding the bag. Republic Command just intercepted a distress call. A Resistance medical facility is about to be overrun. I'd go, but an Imperial armor column's in my way. I need you to save that medical facility. I'll break that siege. Where am I going? I'm sending the medical facility's location. I don't know what you'll be facing there, but do whatever you must to save the Resistance fighters. I'll meet you there as soon as I can. May the Force be with you. Know what gets me? Wasting all our time blowing up bad guys. Imagine how much better the galaxy would be if we focused on helping the needy, not fighting Sith. Until the Sith are defeated, there's only so much we can do. Not arguing that, just planning for the future. It's time Jedi got political. Letting Senators run the Republic? Not working out. We get the big picture, have the power to make things better. We should have control. Tell me I'm wrong. The Senate's useless. If Jedi were in charge, there's nothing we couldn't do. Exactly. Tell you what, I'll be Supreme Chancellor, you run the military. Play to our strengths. No point running for office until the war's over. Let's go win it already. I'm sorry to detain you, Master Jedi, but this is an emergency. We're trying to break an Imperial occupation on Balmora, but the Republic's got no ground, no resources, and right now, no chance. The Republic's made up of worlds that didn't have a chance. History hasn't exactly been repeating itself lately. The stakes are too high here. Balmoran factories produce the most powerful weapons in the galaxy. Possess them, win any war you want. The Republic must retake Balmora. But we need reinforcements. Is Balmora a complete war zone? We've managed to make a beachhead in a place called Bugtown that the Empire overlooked. Commander Maydeen requested all reinforcements see him at Republic Headquarters. Can he expect you? I believe the Empire's worn out their welcome. From the stories I hear, I think the Balmoran people would agree. I'll inform the Commander. You'd better get on board. Good luck. Tell me what's happening. 
Maguli ji want the hompa. Muli ra want the wampa. Was da mi cha kol kuka du maji. Ta us hagwa upa. Why don't you let me deal with this? Faguta ji oto endia. I'm a Jedi. This is what we're here for. Nira disa slimo crispa to danki kung ke kupa. Ja poko otum gisa chobod i kafu anchawa. Lieutenant Hollis told me he'd found the best help in the galaxy, but I wasn't expecting a Jedi. I'm Commander Medin. We both know why you're here, so I'll lay out the details. The Empire's taking control of Balmora's satellite defense system. It's only a matter of time before they find Bugtown and blast us out of this swamp. If you know Bugtown's in danger, you should evacuate. And lose the only part of Balmora we've got? Leaving won't solve our problems. The Empire's got us cornered. As long as they have that satellite system, they're going to keep Balmora. But if we could get control of the satellite system, we could turn it on the Empire and even the score. The satellite system must have a weakness. All we know is that it's well protected. My scouts and SIS agents can't even get close. My best agent managed to gather some intel, but he never made it back. His ship was shot down. I need someone to enter Imperial territory, find Agent Jago's downed ship, and recover the intel. How do you know the Empire doesn't already have it? If the Empire has cracked Agent Jago's encryption, we'd be hearing about it elsewhere. Trust me. Use this decryptor to verify the intel's contents. Then contact me through the comm station at the shuttle pad. If your agent's alive, I'll find him. I've seen the satellite system at work. Nothing gets past it. I'll wait for your comm call. Good luck up there. I love what they've done with the place. You could almost forget this was a colicoid nest. Thank <laughs> you. 
chicos pa inigo dae ji liska janegawa. Wama oto chako ga huta pawa to bampa wula. Jedi bought us some time. Get our wounded to the secure area. Move it! I'm the chief medic. Just call me Doc. I appreciate your hard work, Gorgeous. But there's a whole nest of colicoids coming. No time to evacuate. I'd never let anything bad happen to a nice guy like you. Not even if I asked nicely? I've got dozens of wounded here. Hope you're not one of those junior Jedi. Do we have to save him too? I'll head for the secure area and stabilize casualties. Here they come! alive if the tunnels stay open. You can collapse them with your Jedi tricks, right? Hey, look at that. We are alive. Nice work. A lot of wounded here. You're the only doctor? Honey, I do the work of ten medics. And that's on a bad day. Say, you might be wounded and not know it. 
Let me check you over. I feel fine, but you're the doctor. Let's see. Uh-huh. Hmm. Well, you'll certainly need a more thorough exam. Later. I don't know what genius picked a colicoid breeding ground for our medical facility, but we need to evacuate quick. Problem is, my critical patients are too fragile to move, and the Empire stole my trauma kits. I won't let the Empire endanger your people's lives. How can I get what you need? Our scouts say the Imperials sent my trauma kits to their frontline troops on the plains nearby. The depots will be heavily guarded, but I'm sure you'll figure something out. Just hurry. These people don't have much time. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes. You're standing in a Republic outpost. Impossible. Now I have observed several lapses in Imperial protocol. I have located the crash site of Shadow Squadron. Poor brave men. The transponders in the Dan fighters continue to function. If properly decoded, the Resistance could use the transponders to track other Imperial ships and blast our noble pilots out of the sky. So the Imperial fleet plans on a lot of these attacks. Effective in thinning the Balmoran resistance numbers. A Republic officer named Sergeant Duran is helping the resistance. He is responsible for Shadow Squadron's untimely demise. The transponders must not reach Sergeant Duran. They must be destroyed. I will recommend the fleet target his camp. I'm always happy to work on my lightsaber techniques. Show the Republic our superior strength. Leave no survivors. The debris is spread across the area. I have uploaded the coordinates to your communicator. I will await further repairs. Long may we serve the Empire. Hmm. How do I change? 
change the power pack. Master Jedi, you probably think guns are barbaric, but can you show me how to use this? I'm taking the fight to those Imperial scumbags. I owe it to my squadron. What happened to your squadron? Now they're salvaging our flyer's databanks. They've got our weapons, specs, orders, briefings, everything. I have to get those databanks back and take out those guns. Trouble is, the place is guarded by shock troops. Real hardcore fighters. You're not experienced enough for a mission this dangerous. Let me take your place. I don't know. I really want to do something to stick it to the Empire. But maybe you're right. There's more chance of success if you do it. Then I can get back up in my fighter. Just hurry. The Empire will fight to the last breath to keep those data banks. If they manage to decode them, mine won't be the last dead squadron.
time. Sergeant Jolas, I have the data banks, and all gun batteries are down. That means I can get back up in the air again. Plus, I managed to pick off a few Imperials. Hopefully this is the start of a distinguished career. I'll sure try my best. With those guns out of the way, we can get the fleet operational again. Payback time. satellite wasn't enough to shoot me down. The Empire's on the ground already. They'll search the ship and find the intel. I'm blasting the intel out with the garbage. That ought to keep the Imperials busy. The intel's away. I'm going down.
live. Should probably get moving. Galaxy in peril and all that. as new. are insane. Doesn't the Empire realize we just make the droids? Keep your voice down. They control more than just a factory, you know? We're not mass producers. You can't rush the best weapons in the galaxy. That's why the Empire is here, isn't it? We just have to make the best of it. And hope our fortunes change, right? Sergeant Duran. I heard your team tracks Imperial ships. These transponders might help. Kavaji uta kuga huta nupri da bumba wula. Kapuna maletuta ud mishka kabano tesime. Commander Maydeen, I've recovered your intel. The agent didn't make it. Even so, that's the best news I've gotten in a while. There's enough data here to build another satellite system. It's all about more in shorthand. Looks like the system's operated by the Hawkeye techs. The Hawkeyes are the best technicians on Belmora. To control the satellite system, we'll need their help. How do we know they'll want to help? I doubt the occupations made them warm to the Empire. Most of the Hawkeyes are stationed at the satellite control tower, but there's one we might be able to reach. Ian Sarkis. I recognize the name. He's young, but brilliant. Bit of a wisecracker. A Jedi learns to clear the mind of all distractions. I'm more worried that he'll distract the Empire. 
Sarkis works at a well-armed auxiliary satellite station used to spy on the locals. There's an armory on site, and plenty of Imperial troops. He reports to one of the Empire's best, Admiral Rezair. No wonder they've got control. That sounds like first-hand experience talking. Fighting the Admiral is like going up against a dura steel wall. I don't advocate wholesale slaughter, but this whole plan goes belly up if Admiral Rezair finds out. Do what you have to, and get Sarkis back to the shuttle pad. He'll tell us where to go from there. Sounds like this should be relatively simple. Let's hope so. We're not going to get another shot at this. I'll be standing by. In Sarkis? Point that thing someplace else, and I'll answer. Yes, you must need me or the satellite system pretty bad. I need you to get me control of the satellite system. I'd consider that fair trade for a rescue. The Empire hasn't paid me since they took over. But if Admiral Rizair discovers you attacked this post just to get me out, he'll know the Republic's up to something. We'll have to make a few stops first so I can cover our tracks. If you can promise this will make a difference. They won't know a blaster from a bantha when I'm through. Just get me where I need to go. I'll do the rest. Watch out. These transmitters used to keep Balmoran predators away. Now they attract them. There. Good as new.
happen. They'll have to go on foot. I was starting to get worried. There's a lot of Imperial movement going on up there. Sarkis sabotaged a few things to keep them busy. Ian Sarkis, sir. I left the Empire a few thank you presents for their hospitality. That's our man. Can you get us control of Belmora's satellite system? Not exactly, but I can shut it down, that's for sure. That's a dangerous task for a tech. Hacking past a Hawkeye defense? I deserve a medal. I can get you one unauthorized command. Then the system will lock up, and it'll take the Hawkeyes weeks to detangle it. That'll have to be enough. How do we make this happen? The hack needs to be planted in the satellite control tower's main computers, right where Admiral Rezaire and his men are stationed. Does the Admiral have any other defenses? Just his track record. Even in defeat, he always manages to strike the last blow. Once the fight's over, just insert this disc into the main control console. It'll upload the hack. I need to get to a computer. Thanks again for the rescue. Taking down Admiral Rosera and his men is a tall order. Are you sure you're up to it? The Admiral will surrender the satellite system, or fall defending it. Knowing the Admiral, surrender isn't an option. Sarkis and I will wait for your signal. We'll be ready. Reminder, mechanized travel is for official business only. Be safe out there.
I got as many trauma kits as I could find. Beautiful. The, uh, kits look good too. He's a walking hormone. Apologies for being late. My detour around those Imperial forces took longer than expected. I was worried. Glad you're here. You've done well saving this facility and its patients. The Resistance has already agreed to help us find the cloaking device prototype. This super advanced gadget you're after? The Resistance can narrow down its location, but we need access to the enemy's computer network. The only connection point is at Sobrik, which is covered in Imperial forces. Troop legions, walkers, heavy bombers. Fun place. Sounds pretty important. Why all the protection? It's the manufacturing capital of the planet. All the best guns get made there. I believe we can diminish the Imperial forces without firing a shot. The Empire has several comm relays around Sobrik tied to other Imperial strongholds. An early warning system. Great. When we attack, they can summon more troops to kill us. Or we make the Imperials think we're attacking their other strongholds. We'll infiltrate those comm relays, upload fake alerts, and siphon away Sobrik's defenders, leaving it vulnerable. I doubt the Empire leaves its comm relays unguarded. The comm relays are protected by advanced Imperial war droids. Very fast, extremely deadly. I'm no longer quick enough to defeat those war droids. But you are. Then the Resistance can raid the Empire's computer network. We'll figure out where they've stashed that whatchama thingy it you want. Use this data pad on the comm relays to upload the fake emergency signals. I'll find a good vantage spot to watch Sobrik and keep you informed of our progress. Be careful out there. The Empire may be calling the shots at Okara now, but they don't own me. This is a golden opportunity. Great. The Empire overruns my workplace and suddenly I'm a traitor. I'm in a perfect position to ruin their operations, but the Republic won't even hear me out. If you've got a plan to sabotage the Empire, let's hear it. Gladly. For the past few months, my factory's been putting together a massive shipment of battle droids for the Empire. In the interest of quality assurance, I developed the virus and uploaded it to one of the droids, just to see what would happen. The droid malfunctioned, violently. Now, imagine if we infected the entire shipment of droids with that virus. The Empire would have a horde of rampaging battle droids to deal with. An incident like that could shake the Empire's faith in droids altogether. It's just a matter of distributing the virus to all the units. We've been using special relay droids to upload all the necessary programming to the combat models. If we infect the relay droids, they should transmit the virus to the rest. I'd do it myself, but they're guarded by sentry drones. If you can get past those sentries and upload the virus, you'll corrupt thousands of the Empire's droids. Will you do it? I doubt those sentries can stand up to a lightsaber. I'll upload your virus. It's about time someone listened. Thank you.
good as new. Enough! This ends here. The Republic shall have used you better, Jedi. Healing the injured or escorting refugees? Such a waste. You forced the Republic off Balmora once. It won't happen again. The Jedi does not appreciate my offer of mercy. The Empire controls Balmora. The greatest weapons in the galaxy are now in the hands of its strongest power. If the Republic insists on fighting those odds, Balmora will suffer for it. Whatever you've done, you'll pay for it. In wasted time with a fool, it appears. One satellite defense system, courtesy of me. How's that for the rookie, Hawkeyes? Guys, tell me the other Hawkeyes are just ignoring me. It's just me, and a bunch of dead Imperials. Odd. The Hawkeyes don't leave their posts. Unless it's to help nice people like you. Looks like the hack worked perfectly. I can get one command in before the system locks up. Just say the word and I'll... No. No! This can't be! The Hawkeyes are being executed! Admiral Razier's orders. Stay calm. Where would the Admiral do this? I can use the satellite system to locate their position. These orders are less than an hour old. If you hurry... Starkus, assault's already begun. There's an Imperial Command compound. Can't locate. Destroy our defenses. Use the satellite system to find command. Shut down dispatch console. Mating out. Well, I'm really torn up about a bunch of stuff being destroyed. But we're talking life or death here. We've only got one command. We have to use it to find the Hawkeyes. Do it. I won't let innocent people die. The Hawkeyes are being held in the Okara droid factory. We're lucky. That's not too far away. I brought down their biggest defenses with the turbo lasers, but there's still a lot of Imperials inside. If the Hawkeyes are still alive, I'll save them. I can't thank you enough. Now hurry.
lak apa jam kam gam am kanem nang am panem nang me buwa inok yang pelu am ka kalami ayak kira me buwa ripo nane kari maraka am ka jaku klibek me marak ne bap sounds like the right thing to do em kanaya nukan kinim naya lak umluk mege nem amak kubkap kramanik umluk kiga maya mak Kampelem ganam bagi yang manik hikup bukam. get moving galaxy in peril and all that
Saved us. I didn't think anyone knew we were here. The Imperials were gonna use us for target practice. We owe you one. Get yourself somewhere safe. We're gonna run until there's no more Imperial flags. Thank you again.
hardly move.
I just ran a full diagnostic on our droids. Looks like they've all been infected. They won't go ballistic until they've been shipped and deployed. But when they do, watch out, Imperials. This wouldn't have happened without your help. The Republic doesn't realize what you've done for them. Don't forget your part. You acted in spite of their distrust. I had to do something. Otherwise, I really would be the Imperial scum they think I am. So long as the Republic thinks I'm a traitor, the Empire will too. Might as well stick around, do some more damage. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes. Be safe out there. You could almost forget this was a colicoid nest. Welcome back. The satellite system's down and the battle's over. I've been in some intense ops before, but that... Let's just say Bugtown never looked so good. We're holding the Empire back by the skin of our teeth. Freeing captive civilians wouldn't have been my choice. I made the only choice I could as a Jedi. But what's right isn't always what's best. Either way, we'd likely be standing in a bombed-out mess if it wasn't for you. You've got my thanks. There's a lot of Balmora left. What's your next move? Get into more populated areas. Start contacting the locals. Our next major offensive is Imperial Headquarters in the city of Sobrik. There's a sizable Balmoran resistance set up nearby. Beck Talrat, the resistance leader, requested our aid. But the satellite system kept us from answering. I'd like to send you. Anyone fighting the Empire can consider me an ally. Beck's a bit of a patriot. He'll like your attitude. I'll let Beck know you're heading in that direction. He'll be waiting. I've got to get back to troop deployment. I'm certain we'll cross paths again. Mechanized travel is for official business only.
Kasi yaw yung choy rato ko pati ko yun ta. Do pa maski it kit tuka. Do jarat ro da pori yama. What's this all about? Ni chong ka vapa ko ta magusa. Those Imperials are no match for a Jedi. What who ma the water don we wanti wakoba jakamuka? Or the one ubikili wata bunga toka putonga lurda. Chipokma utmagisa, chopoba if kaftu and java. I took out those Imperials and recovered your supplies. Jeez, Kakava Koyota. Do Banda Bakawanki. Do 
Fugus and Nobi Chonky. Fakota G. Otto and Diha. Jessica Coli Raka Kanchanga. Bumba Kumchinka. as new. as I hoped. The Empire mobilized an entire armored battalion. Keep up the good work, my friend. This time we'll sneak in through the ga ow! Treat the wound! Don't poke at it like an impatient Jawa. Sorry, sir. We've got company. Oh, hello there. I'm uh, Sergeant Carnes. This here's Private Anlin. We're trying to recover some Imperial intel, preferably without getting shot. Again. What sort of information are you after? Command sent us to retrieve data recorders from crashed Imperial starships. They contain valuable intel on the Empire's planetary defenses. This is insane, sir. Why should we keep risking our necks when we have a Jedi right here? You seem to think these recorders are worth dying for. It could be the works. Imperial fleet positioning, clearance codes, battery placement. Uh, maybe Anlin's right. That information could help the Republic fleet establish a solid foothold on Balmora. Bring us one step closer to liberating the planet. I'm not leaving here without those recorders. But we simply aren't equipped to get past those lunatics. Can... can you get them? You two rest here. I'll handle this. I hate to have someone else fight my battles for me. I appreciate this. You've got your reinforcements. Master Jedi, I'm honored you're willing to take up our cause. I'm Bek Talrat, and this is Colonel Marek. We welcome anyone who's willing to fight for our free Balmora. I requested backup because we've set our sights on the city of Sobrik. It's currently Imperial Headquarters. What happened to Sobrik's citizens? The Empire destroyed everything Balmoran and covered the city with their blasted red banners. Colonel Marek is the most decorated officer in the Balmoran militia and our man inside the Empire. Our best bet into Sobrick is an aerial assault, landing in the spaceport and surprising them. Our transport's an old Republic model. She can carry enough men to challenge the Empire. But the spaceport shield disables any non-Imperial craft, and all the false promises in the galaxy won't deactivate it. Balmora's not a safe place to fly. When you're welcome, it's safe enough. When you're not, well, you can see why everyone's fighting over it. 
We've gotten our hands on the Troida Disruptor, a prototype weapon that could break through Sobrik's shield. The Empire has fail-safes in place, and the Troida Disruptor will only work for a few minutes. Luckily, that's all we need. But activating it requires enough power to launch a Star Destroyer, and we don't have it. The only thing that's got that kind of juice is Sobrik's power grid, the largest set of generators on Balmora. You've seen one generator, you've seen them all, right? No. The Empire, anticipating an attack, has positioned fully armed garrisons at each generator. If you can get past them and siphon power from the generators, we can activate the Troida Disruptor and break through Sobrik's shield. Ready your men. I'll have that power when you need it. I'll monitor the power grid from here and contact you when everything's in place. Good luck. new. are exceeding my expectations. Sobrik's forces have been cut by almost two-thirds. Keep up the pressure.
Perfect. Sobrich's defenses have been reduced to the bare minimum. The resistance team is heading in. I think it's best if you follow and keep an eye on them. Too much is riding on this mission. I'll make sure our allies come back alive. The resistance team identified a vehicle depot as their best access point to the Imperial computer system. Transmitting the grid coordinates now. I'll continue monitoring Sobrick. If I see trouble, I'll alert you immediately. Keep our new friends safe. Over and out. Control of Sobrick's power grid. Diverting power to the Troida disruptor. That's it. Transferring you to Beck Talret. Sobrick's shield will only be down for a few minutes, so make it quick. The Troida disruptor is activated. Sobrick's spaceport shield is breaking down. I can't thank you enough. You can thank me later. Let's get Sobrick back. You'll be the hero of Balmora when we win Sobrick. I promise you. I'm impressed. Those garrisons were tough, and I should know. I was forced to design them. Beck's got good men, but they're not fighters like you and me. They'll need your help to retake the city. Enter Sobrick through the main gates. Fight through the Empire and make your way to the spaceport from there. The Resistance looks up to you. Keep them going till I get there. I won't lose, Sobrick. Not this time. See you inside.
live. Have you accessed the Imperial Network? Already downloaded everything. We were leaving when the Imperial Medical Transport landed for refueling. Avers and his men opened fire. Thalmoran scum! Murderers! My men are dying. We'll never reach the Med Center now. You just made my season, Imp. Bet you've got some choice gear on that transport. Greedy vermin! These soldiers were defending Balmora! There's a doctor here. He could keep your men alive. You just love irony, don't you? Do you read? Color cord nests stirred up by fighting. Waves of them headed for Sobrik's outskirts. Leave now or you'll be surrounded. Color cords? They'll rip us apart! Every man for himself! Move! We can't flee! Those beasts will kill us! I don't abandon wounded men, even Imperials. Then again, being eaten wasn't on my agenda for today. Hmm? Hmm. I can save these soldiers if someone keeps the colicoids off me. You work your medical magic. I'll take on the colicoids. May the force be with us. If we die, at least it'll be heroic. But we're not gonna die, right? You hear that? They're here! <laughs> off my relaxing vacation list. I have done some crazy things, but this beats them all. That was heroic. These men owe you their lives. So do I. I want every Imperial on Balmora to know how a Jedi and a Resistance Doctor saved your lives. I'd never falsify a report, no matter how distasteful. Leaving here would be a lot easier if there was another transport. Actually, I did see a speeder bike outside. Only seats one. Hmm. I'll find my way out, Doc. The speeder bike is yours. Just don't want to be a burden on you. Better this way. Your friend warns at these coordinates. I'll meet you there. Good luck.
You've lost, Beck. Your men are dead and your ship's in flames. What? How could you do this to us? Here come your reinforcements. Ask them if you don't believe me. What's this all about? We've been betrayed. Colonel Merrick's joined the Empire. Please, don't make this hard. Surrender or die. Those are your options. What do you get for your part in this? When the Empire came, the Republic fought, lost, and left. Belmora needs order, stability, and power to survive. Our future is with the Empire. You can't truly believe that. Help me defeat the Imperials. The Republic didn't learn anything from being outmatched. You're no different. Hear that, Beck? Your backups refuse to surrender. Don't make the same mistake. Tell me someone won that firefight! The Imperials are dead. The spaceport's secure. I just hope their dead equals ours. Colonel Merrick was respected and revered all over Balmora. If word of this gets out, we'll lose face. And that means losing support and manpower. You coward. Weak and spineless, just like the Republic. The Colonel was once a hero. Let him die like one. Kill him, and put him in with the others. I'll say he fell in combat. Killing the Colonel won't bring your men back. He lives. I thank you for that. Maybe you can pass some of that spine over to Balmora. Despite the Colonel's best efforts, you've won us the spaceport. Solric will be a battlefield for a few days, but we'll get it under control. Meet me back at the Troida workshop. I'll be waiting. This place used to crank out top-of-the-line weapons before the war. I managed to retrieve all of the data recorders. Perfect timing, too. Anlin just finished dressing my wounds. Not too shabby, Private. Oh, thank you, sir. Once that intel gets analyzed, the fleet will finally start making some headway on this planet. I'm glad to have been a part of it. I'll transmit this data back to base. We should be able to step up our offensive any day now. It's over. Solbrick is free. I didn't think I'd live to see it. Of course, all the talk is about a Balmoran hero turned Imperial. We look like idiots. There'll be desertions. Colonel Merrick's rotting away in a secure storage room. Once the Empire's gone, he'll get a proper jail cell. 
A lot of Balmorans died today. Colonel Merrick would have been one too many. I can't really fault you for doing what you thought was right. Winning Solbrick didn't go exactly as planned. But with the city free, people will know it's only a matter of time before they're free too. Commander Maydeen wants to speak with you. We've got him waiting on comm call. Did the commander say what it was about? He didn't say, and I didn't pry. Balmora will never forget what you did for us. Thank you again. Commander Maydeen, I was told you wanted to speak with me. Solberg is free, and we have you to thank. A battalion should be in the city soon, though it'll be a long slog. You've proven your commitment to Balmora and the Republic. I've been authorized to ask for your help with a top-secret mission. We've already invaded Imperial territory and liberated Sobrik. What's left? The Republic didn't even know this objective existed until the Empire forced us off-world. The Balmorans hit it well. Let me introduce Dr. Karsiri, a scientist at the Balmoran Arms Factory. The lead scientist now, actually. Not that that matters. I don't lead armies or free cities like you. Dr. Karsiri is braver than he admits. He's working on the whole reason the Empire's fighting for Balmora. The Barrager Planetary Defense System. What's so special about this weapon? The Barrager can destroy an entire orbiting fleet without launching a single ship. The host planet becomes an impenetrable fortress. We can't do anything to the Barrager unless we can control it. For that, we need someone who knows the weapon inside and out. The weapons designers are Dr. Meln and Dr. Ortis. They refused to work for the Empire and were imprisoned in the Gorinth Brig. Are you certain they're alive? The Gorinth Brig holds people who are inconvenient, not damned. Dr. Meln and Dr. Ortis are the only people who can get us the Barrager. They must get out of the Gorinth Brig safely. My scout Wes Durga is on the Gorinth Plateau. Speak with him. He'll know how to get inside and free the doctors. Be careful, Dr. Karsiri, or you might be next. Don't worry. Being a real-life traitor is making me extra cautious. Keep me updated, Commander. I'll do what I can to keep the Empire busy here. Good luck. I hear you two had quite an adventure in Sobrick. I'm impressed by your commitment to saving lives. We make a pretty great team. We should do this more often. Our mission isn't over. What's the next step? This is Nicolan Cord, one of the top resistance leaders. He analyzed the data we obtained from Sobrick, found us a lead. One of our spies was captured weeks ago, attempting to steal what might be the Empire's cloaking device project. The data revealed where she's being held. Sounds like someone we should talk to. How do we free her? We believe she's inside an Imperial Tactical Operations base. Heavily fortified, protected by a regiment of troops. Well, that's where I come in. Colonel Finley commands the Republic's 5th Expeditionary Force. He's agreed to assist our operation. Trouble is, if that tech op space crew sees my troops marching in, they'll close the blast shields. Those shut, there's no getting them open. If the enemy seals the base, we lose our connection to the cloaking device prototype. One of you Jedi could slip inside, disable the blast shields before they close, then the base would be ours. We'd have to distract that Imperial regiment, create an opening. My troops provide quite a distraction. The Resistance must be part of this. Our spy won't talk if I'm not there. I'll escort the Resistance. That leaves you to penetrate the base and deactivate those blast shields ahead of our arrival. Get your forces ready, Colonel. We leave immediately. I can guarantee an enthusiastic response. I'll prepare my forces to move out. That resistance leader. Let's keep an eye on him. 
His spy is the key to our victory, and he knows it. Get inside the Empire's base and deactivate those blast shields. We'll be waiting for your signal. Major, I really wish you'd think again. I appreciate you patching up my men, Doctor. But there's a reason civilians aren't looked to for military advice. You, however, are just what the Doctor ordered, so to speak. The Imperials are sitting on key targets, and my entire platoon's been poisoned. Are your men going to be alright? They're a few shades greener than healthy, but they should pull through, the ones who survived. The Imperials have turned the surrounding region into a toxic sinkhole. The vapors have been downing us. The Empire dumped a whole mess of herbicides when they first invaded. Ruined an entire season's worth of crops. Eh, yeah, right. Crops. Anyway, any troops I send are rendered helpless by the toxins before they're picked off by Imperial patrol droids. Isn't there any way to protect yourself from the toxins? We've tried everything. Enviro suits, armored transports. Pretty remarkable for anti-vegetable weaponry. Fortunately, we've cooked up a formula that'll burn those toxins out of the ground. You'll get rid of the toxins, all right, and destroy the soil in the process. These farmlands are some of the most fertile on Balmora. The harvests are sold all over the planet. People will starve without them. Do you have a better solution? I know it's risky, but if you can get me samples of the toxins, I should be able to develop a workable vaccine for our soldiers. We don't have time to play scientist. I need your help dispensing the formula we have. I can count on you, right? I'm with the doctor on this one. Let's make that vaccine. I was starting to think the Republic had lost all sense. Thank you. I'll need several soil samples. Also, the toxin may cause some unpleasant side effects. So, work quickly. Bad news, my friend. The Empire just landed heavy war droids in the region. Hunter killers. The droids are patrolling the territory between you and the objective. If they detect you heading for that Imperial base, they'll raise an alert. risk the base's blast shields closing before you get there. You'll have to disable those war droids quickly. Scrapped Imperial war droids coming right up. I'm sending the latest reconnaissance data on the war droids' positions. Eliminate them and continue on to the Imperial base. Never a dull moment. We should visit war zones more often. There, you have the data. Be careful. Over and out. Jungobed, stavo lutu mul nuns un zaktas. Musu tugu, no gushle zoruku. I had no knowledge of any of this. Kumun haba u kunit mek wasta mahala. Provata gahal gurefes, sugurutu ta selvagu. 
Violence only begets more violence. Pronteza banhal kuf joen kwatma. Ul kwaluta meta jur her fut prasunu jormola. Uma ormalo mentu gorastuk. Looking to trade? Not much, but I need some creds. Anything that'll bring my crop back. Not much I can do about debris all over my land. This planet's gone to pot since the Empire arrived. No food, no law, scavengers everywhere. Yesterday, I had to buy off some Mandalorians. Mandalorians? Here. Start carrying a blaster, friend. We're caught in a war. It won't end soon. Buka kampak nijit, tonka yiliska chanaga. Chaskruni do pat kuri ra, do kanki kung. Ni at am bumpa, boshuda mokili mokranki. A ship is everything to a good pilot. Che chopa kuma ni umpi, but malia bedwana ni bobo. Patoga wata kiko uba kiri wata buki donko. Kabano tase makipuna, mali tuta udmishka. Sounds like things are headed in a dark direction. Piti do tenya go kaka jujo, da biska ku paliya. Se gota do muti ki hasa da punyo, lis di woto. Pampa wula ji ota kakoga huta nupisto. The resistance needs everything it can get. Kupa tonti toki maki chisa chubolo wawuni. Kuchusa yo mata chitoya. Nam kanoya choski nawi. Buka kampak nijit. Tonka yiliska chanaga.
your step. That's a long drop down. Belmore has apparently never heard of railings.
there. Good as new. Warren, I've disabled the base's blast shields. It's wide open for you. We're almost there, but Colonel Finley detects a reactor surge coming from the base. Looks like the base commander initiated a self-destruct sequence. You don't have much time to stop it. Shut down all the security consoles in there as fast as you can. Hurry! Self-destruct aborted. The base is ours, Warren. Send in the troops. What are you doing here? I'm busting you out, sweetheart. Where else would I be? I'm sure the Imperials weren't kind to your friend. Make sure she's all right. We thought we'd lost you, Metal. She's healthy as ever. Life signs green across the board. It's a relief. Mattel, what have you learned about the Empire's cloaking device? Imperial scientists left Balmora with the prototype when the Republic invaded. It's long gone. Mattel, I sense great conflict within you. I know you're lying. What are you afraid of? Wait just a minute. She's one of us. Warren wouldn't accuse her of lying unless he was certain. The truth will come out. Wouldn't you rather be the one who reveals it? When Nicolin hears the truth, he'll want to kill me. Promise you'll stop him. No one will hurt you. Tell us everything. Take it easy. Whatever this is, we'll work it out. The Empire offered me a deal. Cooperate or die slowly. I told them everything about the Resistance. Names, locations, plans. I knew it. The Empire has been slaughtering our people using your information! Give them something they can use. Tell them about the cloaking device. The Empire is studying it at the Balmoran Arms Factory. It's there, I promise. What kind of security does this Balmoran Arms Factory have? Their defense grid's the tightest on the planet. I got in, but I couldn't get out. You know the price of betrayal. Wait, 
She has enemy intelligence. She could be an asset. Colonel Finley needs information on the Empire. You work for him now. I'm sorry, Nicola. I had no choice. Metal was ours to punish. The Resistance will not forget this insult. Neither will I. Thanks for saving her. I owe you. The Balmoran Arms Factory is the Empire's biggest stronghold. Assaulting this base was one thing, but taking on that fortress... I know that place inside out. Need a shortcut through that Rancor's den? Well, I'm your man. What would a medic know about a weapons factory? Ran a hospital there when it was resistance territory. I still know people inside. His knowledge and expertise will come in handy. Take him with you. Hey, if the Imperials attack with grenades, you can throw Doc on them. Colonel Finley and I will coordinate a full offensive against the Empire. We'll clear you a path to the Balmoran Arms Factory. The rest is up to you. Get that cloaking device prototype at all costs. May the Force be with us. I've got the access key to the Gorinth Brig. Uma, or malo mentu Gorastuk. Rugul of Namul Kunfu Ensesque nu unswat. If he already thinks that, he might be willing to make it true. Regostura gas elef molu baugoda. Junstabu fuqua lanqua. They'll still get a chance to surrender, even if they won't take it. I brought you the toxin samples. Perfect. These ought to have everything I need to get started on that vaccine. Just be quick about it. Don't worry, you'll be butting heads with Imperials in no time, Major. And then we'll work on clearing out the toxins without damaging the soil. When do you think the farmlands will finally be restored? Hard to say. Probably can't start until the Imperials are gone. But at least the option is there. You showed a lot more insight than the rest of these Republic knuckleheads. Your supplies, Captain, and a little something from the Corvani. Wanta humpa, muri rava fupa jibampa wula. Se gota do muti kihasa da punyo, lis di woto. The Balmorans could use a good pilot. Mitisa roda, kopana chapurko utman gisa? Chikos pa ini good dad ijigliska chanagawa.
it's no use. You need an extractor's ID card to operate that elevator. Don't worry about the elevator. Tell me how to open this cell. Get out of here while you still can. The extractors will be back any... Not very chatty now, are you, old man? Looks like we have a security breach. And some new prisoners. The extractors are dead? And you saved us. I, I can't believe it. Do you need medical attention? I've never felt better. I could run circles around this prison. Or, you know, kilometers away from it. I know Lieutenant Vecker rarely leaves his interrogation rooms on the lower level. He keeps the most valuable prisoners close by. Here, take the extractor's ID card. If you're looking to free someone else, you'll have to get onto the lower level to do it. You've been of tremendous assistance. Thank you. You bust me out of an Imperial prison and you're thanking me? Well, maybe I'm dreaming. I'm getting out of here before more extractors show up. Good luck to you. Idiots, did none of you think to stop an intruder? Or are we issuing invitations? No matter. You won't disrupt the work I'm doing to stabilize Balmora. Call this torture what you will. It ends here. I must maintain order. Fear discourages rebellion. Whether you're here out of some misguided attempt to save these criminals, or you're after Republic interests, you won't succeed. The Gorinth Brig and everyone in it serves the Empire. They live for it, they die for it. 
Release the prisoners and you can go free. And start a planet-wide riot? No wonder the Republic's falling apart. Disarm the intruder. Alive if possible. Dead as an example. <laughs> Dr. Malin? Dr. Ortis? Doctor. Dr. Ortis. Uh, just give me a minute to catch my breath. I thought that fight would never end. Forgive him. This whole experience has been traumatic. Dr. Melne, at your service. I can't believe you went to these lengths to rescue us. Thank you. I was told you designed the Barrager. I hope I'm not wrong. The Empire imprisoned us because of the Barrager, and now the Republic set us free. I think I know why you're here. The Barrager is an incredibly complicated and well-protected weapon, as designed. Luckily, our design notes are in contraband. We can use Lieutenant Vecker's credentials to override the security system and get those files. It'll lock down afterwards, of course, but we'll have what we need. Can the override do anything else? Change prison operations, security settings, nothing that's gonna help us now. With our files, we can create a foolproof spike for the Republic, guaranteed to get control of the Barrager. Wait just a minute. What about all those prisoners? You might have forgotten everything we've seen here, Doctor, but I haven't. This is our chance to destroy this terrible place. We have to use that override to let these people go. As for the Barrager, we'll figure out something. The Gorinth Briggs caused enough suffering. You may have just single-handedly condemned the Republic. The thanks of a thousand prisoners should make up for it. The override worked. Every security field in the Gorinth Brig has failed. We should get to a shuttle. Dr. Mel and I will do our best to get something together for the Barrager Spike. Thank you. Ut termo nulu uma. Did Dr. Melon and Dr. Ortis make it back? Gahal Ravul as John Ujwet untumata. Juguhu zu za haga, noexa nunsa bahala. I'm glad you're back. We've got no time to waste. Dr. Melon and Dr. Ortis have created the Barrager Spike. It's hacked together from memory, so they can't guarantee anything. We really could have used their research. It's hard to ignore a prison full of innocent people. You eliminated most of the prison staff. Once we had the Barrager, they wouldn't have waited long for a rescue. I just hope the spike works. The Barrager could prevent another Telos or Taris forever. The Republic must get control of it. Our plans hit a small snag. We've been unable to get in touch with Dr. Karsiri, the informant who started all this. You suspect the Empire discovered him? Dr. Karsiri's brilliant, but I doubt he has much experience covering his tracks. The Empire's massing their troops at the Belmoran Arms Factory. It's a battle from here on in. We've got to move forward, with or without Dr. Karsiri. My technician Len Carter's been working on locating the Barrager. He's waiting for you at the Sundari outpost. Tell Em I'll be there as soon as possible. I'll keep trying to contact Dr. Karsiri. I'll let you know if I hear from him. Medine out. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes.
se cota do muti ki hasa da punyo, lis di woto. Che chopa kuma ni umpi but malia bedwana ni bobo. I'm no Republic officer, but I'm here to help. O grani tampi o da pushi wompa, pu tula musta. Chascruni do pat kurira do kanki kung. Poya toka changa goptula do batawana wanki. That's a big target for civilians to hit. Patoga wata kiko uba kili wata buki donko. Ni at ambumpa boshura mokili mokranki. Including any moves to bring it down. Tauz azulas uval tung ni chakulka dimaji. Kupa tonti toki maki chisa chubolo wawuni. Kuchusa yo mata chitoya asubi mota uipa. It will be a privilege. Poya toka changa goptula do batawana wanki. I'm looking for Lem Carner. You found him. Good thing, too. Now you can take this off my hands. It's the Barrage Spike. Commander Maydeen sent it over. Your job is to use that to take control of the Barrager. My job is to find it for you. I guess there's been no word from Dr. Carceri. Not a peep. That's why you're dealing with an old tech like me. It takes a lot of power to destroy a fleet. I can trace where it's going and locate the Barrager that way. But the Empire's got power-hungry contraptions all over this battlefield. As long as they're up, I can't get a clear reading. Get me? Just tell me where to go. Empires recall their full forces here. Republic's doing all they can, but you've got a literal army to get through. Watch yourself. Knock out everything the Empire's got running. Hook this power monitor up to their primary sensor grid, and we'll find your weapon. If the Empire advances, retreat. I'll figure things out. I was a front lines tech in the Battle of Bathawi. This is nothing. As soon as I've got a lock on the barrage's location, I'll calm you. Stay safe out there.
Signals coming in, clear as a bell. Most of the power is being drawn to the administrative complex of the Balmoran Arms Factory. The barrager must be there. An administrative complex doesn't sound so threatening. Don't be so sure. Probably plenty of security is still standing between you and the barrager. I've got Commander Maydeen on hold for you. If we don't meet again, well, for Balmora's sake, I hope we do. Looks like we were both hard at work. You've got the Barrager's location. I've got Dr. Karsiri. Good thing, too. The Barrager lab's been fortified beyond recognition. Freeing the Gorinth Brig prisoners must have put a scare into the Empire. They're driving us hard to finish the weapon. The Empire's made Darth Minax our overseer. She was a slave driver before, but now... Any minor setback is grounds for execution. Sith are deadly and unpredictable. Be cautious. She's a real, live, red-skinned Sith nightmare. Without their research, Dr. Meln and Dr. Ortis couldn't have anticipated our progress. There's some vital extra steps to making their hack work. I trust you have a strategy. Use the barrager spike on the subsystem controllers, then on the main power core. It'll allow full control when you arrive. I can assure you, I will not fail. You've already done more for Balmora than I ever thought possible. I'd better get back before Darth Minax comes looking. I hope to meet you in person soon. This is it. Follow Dr. Karsiri's instructions and get to the Barrager. Medine out.
chusa yo mata chitoya, nam kanoya choski nawi. Se gota do muti ki hasa da punyo, lis di woto, chonki faguta, chiho poda chi oto fo kise. I'm extremely impressed. Ni at ambumpa po shuda mo kili mo klanki. Kabanotase makipuna, mali tuta od mishka. Poya tuka changa gobtula do batawana wanki. I'll keep my lightsaber ready. Buka kampak nijit, tonka yiliska chanaga.
I'm sorry, Darth Minax. I had the codes put in place, but the locks seem to have... failed. Half the Imperial Army, and still the Republic gets inside. Secure the weapon! You found the Barrager designers among the rest of the rabble you freed, didn't you? Pathetic, idiotic Republic luck! You have no power here. The Empire's lost the Barrager and Balmora. The Republic's won, have they? Was it at Sobrek? The destroyed Gorinth Brig, perhaps? That festering island you call Bugtown? Balmora belongs to the Empire. The Barrager will only remove all doubt. You were very foolish to come here. Perhaps now you'll understand why. <laughs> Dr. Karsiri, is anyone there? We are here, Commander. Darth Minax and the other Imperials are dead. The Barrager is ready to accept your spike. Excellent. Use the Barrager spike to get control. 
I'm sending a recovery crew to take over operations. To take over? But the Barrager is a threat to Balmora. It must be destroyed, you know that! Is something wrong here? What's wrong is that your commander is willing to sacrifice Balmora for a Republic victory. Destroying a fleet takes every bit of power a planet can give. Solar, geothermal, hydro... If it's part of Balmora, it's powering the Barrager. It will leave the planet an empty shell with nothing left to defend. The Empire wanted the Barrager so they could hold Balmora forever. Now I see the Republic does too. Commander Maydeen lied to us. Is this true, Commander? Whatever your assumptions, Doctor, I made it clear that we needed to get control of the Barrager. You never said the Republic planned to use it! You really think we'd destroy something that could prevent another Telos, Taras, or Coruscant? Save millions of lives and guarantee a Republic victory? This war is not over. I can feel it. I know the cost is high, but the Barrager could make sure the Republic wins that war. We have to claim it. We can't sacrifice one planet to save another. Blast it! Do you realize what you're doing? You've given the Empire a second chance! The Barrager's power core is overloading. We have to evacuate. Running for my life. Next time, I'll leave the adventures to a professional. If we don't meet again. Turbo lifts locked down, but don't worry. Slicing Imperial security codes is a hobby of mine. Give me two secs. Uh oh. Someone's coming down the turbo lift. Get behind me, beautiful. I'll protect you. Doc, I thought the amps had killed you. You too, Remy? How you making out, old fella? Same as always. Pretend to cooperate with the Imperials, and stab them in the back every chance I get. We're here to defeat the Empire. 
Can you get us into the upper levels? Sure. The imps put me on waste management. Gave me a data card to get in there. It's all yours. Thing is, there's guards every two meters in there. That's why I travel with a Jedi, Remy. Sorry to cut this reunion short. We have a long fight ahead. And I finally have a way out of this place. See you on the other side, Doc. Hello. Are you there? It's Colonel Finley. We have a new problem. The Resistance has learned of Imperial research into weapons that use cloaking device technology. If the enemy can hide their missiles and bombs from detection, imagine the carnage. The Empire would rip us apart. You must recover all the Empire's research data on this project and deliver it to us. There's bound to be a computer hub up there somewhere. This may be our only opportunity. Do everything you can. Finley out. I found the files about the Empire's stealth weapon research, but something's wrong. They're starting to erase themselves. I use TurboLift data cards all the time when I was here. They work with computers, too. Maybe we can transfer the files onto the data card Remy gave us. Copy them before they get deleted. Work like a charm. Pretty amazing, huh, gorgeous? That was fast thinking. Well done. Fast thinking is my middle name. <gasps> you suppose the Empire knows we're here?
That's far enough. We're almost done here. Nicolin, what are you doing? The cloaking device prototype belongs to the people of Balmora, not the Republic. This is our world, our war, and our victory. You had a shortcut into this place and you didn't tell us? We stole this Imperial transport during the raid on Sobrik. Security here was too busy fighting you to double-check our identification. We spent decades fighting for this planet after the Republic rolled over for the Empire. Now you're back to loot our resources? This prototype may be the most valuable technology on Balmora. You're not taking it. Aren't the Jedi all about justice? If that's true, let us leave with what's rightfully ours. The cloaking device isn't the real prize. The Empire's research is what you want. They learned how to cloak missiles and bombs. Isn't that more valuable to Balmora's future security? I'll give you the data, in exchange for the prototype. Interesting offer. One I'm inclined to accept. You have a deal. I'd offer you transportation, but I'm afraid the shuttle only seats two. Good luck. The Colonel won't be happy, but I'll smooth it over. I'm good with people. One thing's for sure, I'm not working for the Resistance anymore. Got a spare bunk on your ship for a superb combat medic? My mission is dangerous. Sure you want to get involved? Danger doesn't scare me. And involved is my middle name. Warren? I have the cloaking device prototype. After the blood that's been spilled today, that's a ray of hope. I'm returning to the Republic base where you first landed. Meet me there. Was this the Empire's doing? Special squad. Some kind of advanced weapon. Must be from the arms factory. You've got to relax, sir. You might have some internal injuries. Can't. We lose this battle. The Empire gets permanent rights to these weapons. Meaning more work for me. At least sit still, then. I've done as you wished. Pampawula ji ota kakoga huta nupisto. Bagthra Wanawaga mi Bunawa Dwedwipe. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes. Imperials still have stockpiles here. We need two squads up on the Gorinth Plateau. You're back. 
We're in the middle of final troop deployment. The Empire's lost, but they're attacking on their way out. I don't think you realize what you've done. If we had the Barrager, the Imperials wouldn't have fired another shot. The Empire's on Balmora to win. We're here to help. I wanted to give the Republic the best shot I could at defeating the Empire. Were you there when the Empire attacked Coruscant? They came out of nowhere, and we couldn't do anything about it. When the Empire invaded Balmora, I promised myself that it would end here. Can you blame me? Dr. Karsiri risked his life for Balmora, not the Republic. For a scientist, he's got guts. Maybe he can help, if he ever forgives me. I'm glad it was you making the call and not me. When you spend your life fighting, it's easy to forget why. You secured the Barrager, stormed the Gorinth Brig, freed Sobrik. The Republic is completely in your debt. The Empire has to learn that independent worlds aren't theirs to take. Balmora's been an effective lesson. If war breaks out, the Republic will be ready. There's a lot of work ahead, but Balmora's free. That's what's important. Good luck to you. I got the cloaking device prototype, but I had to trade the Empire's weapon research data for it. Yes, so the Resistance leaders informed me. I did not authorize your agreement. The Resistance is afraid we've come to take over their home. Show them we're only here to help, and they may share that data. I'm a soldier, not a diplomat. Somehow I expected such an important device to be more impressive. I'll deliver this to Master Braga and the Council on Tython. Master Braga's faith in you is well placed. I'm honored to serve with you. The feeling is mutual. Be well, my friend. You should contact Master Braga when you return to your ship. He's eager to hear from you. Farewell. Master Braga, the mission to Balmora was a success. We have the cloaking device prototype. Outstanding. I never doubted you for a moment. How did you find working with my old friend Warren? I've always been impressed by his keen insights. His intuition was critical. I couldn't have found the objective without him. You've brought us a great leap closer to finding the Emperor. But there's a new problem. I've lost contact with my Padawan under unusual and dangerous circumstances. You're uniquely qualified to deal with this. I'll do everything I can, Master. Tell me the situation. Sajar is no ordinary Padawan. He was once a Sith Lord, a member of the Empire's Dark Council. We dueled on Dantooine. Fought for three days. I won when I convinced him to abandon the Dark Side and train as a Jedi. You turned a Dark Council member to the Jedi? Incredible. Your own victories are no less impressive. Bengal Maul and former Lord Praven now serve the light side because of you. Sajar has fully embraced the Jedi way. Whatever has happened, it isn't his fault. He was guarding a Republic base on the planet Quesh when the Empire invaded and attacked our territories. You trusted Sejar to guard a Republic base in a war zone? When I sent him, Quesh was peaceful, quiet, a good place for meditation while also serving the Republic. I just spoke with a soldier at Sejar's base. It's surrounded by Imperial forces and my Padawan refuses to act. 
Without Jedi help, that base will fall. My Padawan won't answer his holo. Sounds like he's afraid of something, but what? Only a strong Jedi can help Sage Island save the base. I'm transmitting the planet's coordinates now. Master Braga, out. Go. He needs you. And you need him. Master? Why would I need Sajar? Uh, you alright? The hollow transmission's over. It's a Jedi thing. None of your business. This sounds urgent. We should go to Quesh right away. Looks like old Doc got here just in time. How have you survived with a droid and Little Miss Uptight as your only friends? T7's as loyal as they come, and you should address my fellow Jedi by her name. No offense intended. I stopped listening to names after I heard yours. Before I settle in, a few things. First, I like my quarters kept at least five degrees warmer than the rest of the ship. I only eat energy pudding, so stock up on that. Uh, also, give me 30 minutes in the refresher every morning. That's all. If it wasn't for me, you'd be unemployed on Balmora. Be thankful for what you get. Ooh, a tough negotiator. I like a little fire. We'll get along fine. Never seen a ship's med bay right next to the engine compartment before. Not exactly convenient. I've done better with worse. Until I have everything online, stay in one piece. Doctor's orders. Need a timeout. Got something on Narshada that can't wait. Some old friends are in a tight spot. Promised I'd help. Simple delivery. Done in a jiff. You've never mentioned having friends. I was popular before I joined the Jedi. Now I'm really popular. Narshada has lots of refugees. And the huts? Not known for their charity. People are starving. My friends don't need anything fancy, just med packs and nutrient paste. Stuff I can easily provide. We'll set course for Narshada as soon as possible. Swell. They're already expecting us. Get me to my friends and I'll handle the rest. Kira, you're here. And bearing gifts. How's everyone holding up? Better now. Can't believe it's really you. A Jedi. You're so different. Kira's more than a Jedi. She's a hero. You must be Kira's master. It's an honor. I still remember that little girl. Bundling up in extra layers of clothing. Trying to look... Bigger and tougher than she was. Hey, it worked. Add enough layers and nobody knows who you are. Kira never talks about her past. Nothing to tell. Life was hard and then I became a Jedi. But I never forgot my friends. Inak, distribute the food and medicine. Our people have waited long enough. Go now. This famine, your fault. Our people suffer because of the slaughter you committed in our name, the Orcasax. Who is this man? What's he talking about? Name's Darshin. Been the leader here forever. We have... differences. Orcasags were bad news. Made us their personal entertainment. Robbed, killed, and worse. For fun. I paid the gang a private visit. Asked them nicely to back off. Things got ugly. Gangsters died. You butchered the Urkasags. Made a public spectacle of their deaths and spread terror in our name. Everyone fears us. You say Kira is responsible for the food and medicine shortage. Why? Our reputation frightens away those who could help us. Yet desperate people continue to seek refuge here. We can't provide for everyone. I'll get more supplies to you. I protect my people. Enoch was wrong to bring you back here. Your presence does more harm than good. 
Beggars can't be choosers. Should your people suffer because you're angry with Kira? What she did was wrong. But it doesn't mean you should turn away her help. I'll make it up to you, Darshan. Promise. Your promises mean nothing to me. Everyone so excited you're here, Kira. They want to say thanks. Can you stay a while? Not this time, but I'll be back. Take care of each other until then.